Welcome to the Music Theory Placement Exam. I'm Dr. Brian Jarvis, and I'll be walking you through the process of taking this exam so that you know what to do and what to expect. I've developed this exam along with my music theory colleagues, Dr. Charles Leinberger and Dr. Dominic Dosha. I'll tell you more about the actual exam in the next video, but this video is about getting you into Blackboard in order to take the exam. Before you get started, here is what you need. You will have the most reliable experience if you take the exam using an internet-connected Windows or Mac, laptop or desktop computer. Note you can take the exam using a smartphone or tablet, but this is not recommended, as it will take you longer and it is likely to change your answers by using autocorrect, and it has a tendency to add extra spaces to your answers, which the computer will read as incorrect answers. Again, a Windows or Mac laptop or desktop computer is strongly recommended. You can only take, the, take this exam one time, so you don't want to have unreliable technology get in the way of proper placement in our music theory sequence of courses. Part of the exam includes audio questions, so you will need to use headphones or speakers in order to hear those questions. Make sure to test that your audio is functioning properly before starting. You might test that you are hearing audio through your browser by visiting YouTube and pulling up a video. In general, earbuds are not recommended for careful listening, but they can be used if that's all that's available to you. Make sure you have Google's Chrome browser. You may experience problems if you don't use this browser. It's free and you can download it here at this link. After downloading, you'll need to install it before you can use it. If downloading and installing an internet browser is foreign to you, go to YouTube and search for a video about how to do this. Your computer may already have this software installed. Now open Google Chrome and visit this website, blackboardlearn.utep.edu. This is the page that you'll see. Enter the username and password you were sent in the email you received about taking the online music theory placement exam. This is a special Blackboard account that is completely unrelated to the UTEP username you have received or that you will later receive. Here's an example of what the username and password will look like. The username will be something like sa-music175 and then you'll have a short password to enter here. After logging in, you'll need to click the link pictured here to enter the exam. The link says CC Music Theory Place Exam, Music Theory Placement Exam. After that, you should see the home screen of the exam. And the first item is the next video. And that next video, I will walk you through the exam before you begin. This exam will take approximately one hour to complete. You should make every effort to be undisturbed during this time so that your skill level can be assessed accurately. If you have advising questions, please email Dr. Leinberger at charlesl at utep.edu. If you run into any technical issues at this point, please email me, Dr. Jarvis, at bejarvis at utep.edu. I'll see you in the next video.